Our high school sports previews carry on us tonight. We begin by taking a look at the Bemidji girls tennis team. They've had a lot of success in recent years, but things will be a little tougher this time around after losing multiple key pieces. The Jacks graduated five seniors last year, including players occupying three of the top positions, like Abby Kelm, who graduated with the most wins in school history. And returning players are eager to get back in action and hit the ground running. We're ready to play, and uh, we're not as experienced this year, but we're ready to, ready to get out on the courts. A talented freshman group has made things interesting at the bottom of the lineup as well as they look to make an impact. They're going to push the older girls, and we're, we're seeing that this week already, where right now there's literally 16 girls fighting for 10 spots. I think it's pretty even. Everybody's kind of fighting for those last couple spots that we've got left on the varsity, so it's pretty fun to watch. One thing passed down from last year's team, the importance of mental toughness, which is often the difference. They're all so positive, and they were also driven to play their best, and we really want to bring that into this year's team. Talent-wise, they're really pretty even but who can step up under match conditions and, and play tough, and that's what we're looking for. I think the goal for the season is just to play, play your best game that you can, and if we win, we win. If you don't, you tried your best, so you're good. I really have a good feeling that by the end of the year, we're going to be quite a bit better than we are at the beginning. I think all of our competition at practice is going to make us tough. Bemidji starts off their season against Alexandria on Wednesday and then hosts Thief River Falls the same night under the lights. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.